Also on the fifth, we have Roll Camera, the B-Movie expansion. And this is an expansion for the game Roll Camera, a filmmaking board game where players are working together cooperatively to try and create a movie within the allotted budget and time, but then also creating the movie of a certain quality level. If you're not able to achieve all three of those before the end of the game, then the players lose the game. This is a game that looked like a lot of fun, but I originally passed on it during the first campaign, but since then it's been getting some really raving reviews, and I know Rado over at Rado Runs Through really loves this game as well. So if you also missed out on the first campaign, this is an excellent time to jump in on it, and from what I'm seeing, I think that you can really back this one with confidence. At the start of the game, players draw two cards to determine the type of movie that they're going to make, and those cards actually join together to create a title for your movie, so you'll have the start of the title on one card and the end of the title on the second card. The cards also dictate what sort of scenes that you need to have in your movie in order to hit that target market that you're trying to go for. And this is a game that uses primarily dice worker placement where players are going to be manipulating the dice in the middle of the board to try and set up their movie set. And each round players are going to be drawing a problem card from the problem deck and each card is going to represent some sort of restriction or problem that the players run into. These will resolve over time but they will build up each round if they're not resolved so players will want to try and get rid of them because they're harder and harder to get rid of as more of these cards start to pile up throughout the game. Players will be performing different actions on their turn to try and earn the scene cards that match the requirements that they set up at the start of the game. Any little aspect of these scenes is that when you earn them you put them in order on your board so that you can easily see the progression of your movie and the story that it's telling. And just for fun players can fill in the blanks and tell the plot of the movie at the end of the game although that doesn't actually earn you any victory points or determine whether you win or lose the game. The B-Movie expansion expands on the current content in the game so there's going to be some new roles and specialized equipment for players to use but it's also going to add a new phase to the game so there's going to be a last minute script insert that requires the players to fulfill the unique genre requirements of their movie so that could be different genres such as a crime genre fantasy horror sci-fi or western Great opportunity to get in on this one if you missed out on the first campaign, and since it's a game that's already out, there's a ton of content that you can find to learn more about it, and you might even be able to get your hands on the original if you want to try it for yourself.